Topic. Splitter board function indicator light not flashing. Problem. The green LED function indicator light on the scissor lift splitter board does not flash when receiving an up or down command from a dry contact relay, such as the included low voltage three button wall switch. Solution. Step one. First, verify that the scissor lift is connected to a 110 volt power supply. Step two. Testing for bad connections. Sometimes wiring connections can look good visually, but still not have proper contact. Please check all connections in the following areas. Check the connection between the three button wall switch or the key switch and the supplied low voltage data cables. Check that the low voltage data cables are connected correctly to these switches. Review the proper up, down, and common wire connections to the switches as shown in the installation instructions. Step three, testing for defective wall switches. If all connections are verified for proper contact and the switches and data cables are installed correctly, but the green LED function indicator light is still not flashing when sending an up-down switch command, disconnect the low voltage cable wires from the non-working switch and manually touch off or short out the bare ends of the wires. Touch the common to the up wire and the common to the down wire to see if the lift will now operate or the LED will flash. If it does, the switch is either defective or there is still a bad connection between the switch and the data cable wire leads. Testing for defective data cables. If touching the wire leads does not work, the low voltage data cable may be defective. If you have one working wall switch and one non-working wall switch, try removing the data cable from the working wall switch and replace the data cable from the non-working wall switch. If this causes the switch to start working, the problem was a defective data cable. If this does not cause the switch to begin working, the problem is most likely a defective splitter board. Contact Draper to order and replace the defective part.